everyone, this is Noelle Mendoza reporting for the Star News. We're at the Heart on Center event today where residents are getting a first-hand look on art, entertainment, and music. Well, this is Heart on Center. Um, originally it started because um, our professor from San Diego State was told by a certain someone that the arts are asleep in the South Bay. So this is kind of um, not a retaliation, sort of say, but just to show them that the South Bay is definitely not asleep with arts, as you can see. These are all artists from the South Bay, and it was set up by 15 students, and I'm one of the students from Dr. Filan's um, class. So we worked past the semester, the semester ended in December, and we decided to carry on until now, and so this is the final product of Heart on Center. We wanted to make something that's not just a traditional like painting on canvas. Um, there's all different arts. We have a place um, set up called Raw, and they actually do spray painting, live spray painting. We're gonna have a um, ballet folklorical, we have a lot of musical performances, we have the cutest, tiniest kids who are playing violins way better than I could ever play. So just kind of everything for everyone. It's definitely a family affair. Um, there's a little bit for everyone. Yeah, actually they're called the Creepers. The Creepers. The Creepers. Basically what they represent, they represent the kind of like the insecurities that we're, we're scared to share with other people. Sometimes they're all, of, all of them are, they represent some um, stereotypes or different kind of people, the people that we tend to not talk to in school, the, the kind of people that we see that we say it's creepy. Oh. They are the Creepers. Oh, it's about wow. kind of embracing the, your creepiness. I actually I want to make a fish. So a big round of applause for Chorus! Now, events like this are incredibly important, not only to adults, but they're important to kids as well. And whether a child is 5 or 15, heading towards high school for some young men and women, for some boys and girls. It's the fact that when they go to school, they have a chance to perform on stage. They have a chance to exhibit their artwork that keeps them coming back. For some kids, it's a beloved teacher. For some kids, it's athletics. But if we lose sight of the arts in our education, we lose sight of so many things as adults.